Good morning, guys. I want to get on here real quick and say thanks for being here to watch this video. We really appreciate every view, seriously. If you would see how excited I get for each new subscriber that I see, you would understand that we really appreciate it. I was really nervous to do this sleeping on the boat thing. Kevin really wanted to, so I just sucked it up, went with it, and I wound up really liking it. I mean, I slept way more than I thought I would, and it was really cool waking up that morning, making our breakfast. He wants to do it again. We are going to do it again. Um, he talked about going about 100 miles next time. Don't know if we'll go that far the second time. Maybe 50. But if you have any suggestions of where we should go, let us know. We have gone all the way to Georgetown, South Carolina. And we talked about maybe doing that. If they, I think they have an anchorage there. We need to find out. Again, I appreciate you being here. Appreciate you watching the videos. I know you don't have to, but it's so exciting for me. So, we will see you on our next video, but here you go. This is what happened on our first night sleeping on the boat. We just made it out onto the water. It is buggy as crap, but I'm not going to complain and I'm not going to whine. We'll have our bug net. We're going to go try to find a, maybe, where, oh my gosh, look at that giant bird. But find a place where it's not so buggy. We're going to go all the way out to the intracoastal, I think, to cook so we don't have bugs um, oh gosh, all over us while we eat and then we're gonna put the net up out where it's still breezy and there's no bugs because if we come to where we're gonna stay and put the net out then the bugs are just gonna get in there with us so that's the plan and I hope we can do this and not have the bugs in here we got everything in the boat and we're ready to do it Kevin more ready than me. Oh. Oh my gosh, they're just right here. <gasps> Oak Island Lighthouse. I don't know if you can see it back there. Um, that is Southport over there. That's Kevin. Here's our burgers. We got our burgers going. Kevin's, we, we're not cooking on the grill. This time we're, we brought the camp stove since we're doing breakfast. So we're having burgers tonight. Then I'm going to do s'mores. Then tomorrow morning we're going to fix breakfast out here. We got our burgers ready and we were trying to eat and then the bugs got really bad so now poor Kevin's having to drive while he eats. We weren't expecting that. We got anyway, okay, I'm good. They were biting too, but anyway, it'd be alright. That is pushing some water. And here comes their wake. I need to hold the grill. Don't let the grill fall. Oh my gosh, the hamburgers are going everywhere. <sighs> okay. Yeah. Mm. Our burgers are so good. It's really good. Everything tastes better on the boat anyway. I'm gonna try to hold this still so you can see that's a huge ship. <laughs> oh no. It's hauling too. It has been cloudy and stuff all day, but God did give us a pretty sunset. We're making our way back towards the anchorage and we're going to stop in a little bit and go ahead and put the mosquito net tent cover thing. Well, Kevin's going to put that on while we're out here. Huh? You're going to help. Oh, he said I'm going to help. While we're in the breeze and there are no bugs. 
so that when we get back to the anchorage, we'll be good to go. I hope you can see, we don't have the best camera. I mean, it's a cheaper camera, but he's getting everything set up. Bimini tops up. I about fell in. Oh my gosh. I just about fell Better in. Better get on the bottom of the boat. <laughs> I just about fell in. I gotta watch where the boat is. I gotta... in the way too part of it we just got everything set up and now listen mm -hmm. you don't think they can hear it no. it's raining it's not raining hard we're gonna try to wait it out and see um what it does if it keeps on like this we're just gonna stay okay. <laughs> i'm trying to get where you can see me um we're still oh this is not a good angle they say you shouldn't look down floor. It's still raining. I don't know if you can hear it, but we're trying to wait it out because it's just, it's not raining hard. Looks like there's some more on the radar, but as long as it stays like this and doesn't last too much longer, we are not leaving because poor Kevin just spent all this time getting this canopy up or what is it called? A mosquito net tent thing. I don't know. Anyway, he took a lot of time to get it up. So we're just gonna wait it out and see. We are settled in here. Quit, it quit raining. It, I didn't hear it anymore. I think it's quit raining. I'm getting ready to make s'mores. I think we're gonna make it. What time is it? I don't even know. I don't like 4.30. <laughs> if only. It's 8.42. <laughs> we're ready for bed, I think. Or we'll be pretty soon. 8.42, 4.42, what's the difference? <laughs> it's but, late. It's the middle of the night. <laughs> feels like it. But our bed's not. We don't have our mattress done yet. I gotta do my s'mores first. I think we'll be going to bed early tonight. Hopefully we'll sleep, but I don't know. Kevin doesn't eat s'mores. Rain again. It is. Uh, I have to let him burn for a little bit. Ah, piece of my chocolate fell out. All right, we'll check back in in a little bit. The rain has stopped and we're starting now to get our stuff picked up off the floor so we can put the air mattress so he can blow the air mattress up you know it's 9 32 kevin said i cooked my s'mores too early because now it's time to go to bed there's nothing else to do i just hope the air mattress gets pumped up i'll let you know okay kevin doesn't think this is as funny as i do but how quick was it supposed to pump it up it's supposed to pump it up in two to three minutes. It definitely took longer, but I think it's almost there. You think? Yeah, Fifteen minutes later. <laughs> we forgot pillows. We were doing so good, and then we remembered that we forgot. Kevin remembered that we forgot pillows. But it's fun. It's an adventure, right? <laughs> okay, now you can see a little bit of our set up <laughs> our hillbilly set <laughs> I know when boats come by in the morning they're gonna laugh at us <laughs> we'll be cooking wrecks in the morning they'll be jealous that's true they'll be smelling our breakfast <laughs> let's give you an update it is 4:30. <laughs> Not yet. I wish it was 4.30. This is where we are right now. In this anchorage, see, intracoastal, 
and we're right here. 10 o'clock. It is 4.30. <laughs> quit saying 4.30 every time. It is 11.10. We're still in the boat. Kevin heard a coyote. So we laid here and listened to that for a minute. It is oh, focus 601. We made it all night. Let's see. Let me turn on my flashlight so you can see we're still here. We made it all night. We did it. We made it. I think I already said that when I was showing you the time. Hopefully we'll get to see a little bit of sunrise. It's a little bit cloudy. But our air mattress made it. We were worried we might lose air in it. We're sleeping on a twin mattress, both of us together on a twin mattress. But once I went to sleep, I slept pretty good. I woke up, but I would go right back to sleep. I don't know if you can see those, but the boat that just went by, they were white capping. Oh gosh. Don't come over the back of the boat. It did it. I'm still laying here. I need to get up so I can start making breakfast, but it feels so good to lay here. Here's our little twin air mattress. There's some condensation on some stuff in here, but we kind of expected that. It's just really damp. I mean, it rained last night and it's just damp and cloudy and just kind of yucky. Hopefully, next time we do it, it'll be nicer weather. But I slept pretty good. I slept better than I thought I would. We didn't sleep a long time, but I did sleep better than I thought I would. If I did wake up, I didn't stay awake too long, and then I would fall back to sleep pretty quick. So, I'll do it again, definitely. It wasn't nearly as bad as I thought it would be. So, I'm glad we tried it. Kevin's getting everything set up to cook breakfast. What, two bottles of water? Uh, just one. I'll just do half what I did on our practice run. Breakfast is going. Ooh, I better stir the grits. So gross. That's how Kevin likes them. Thick. I better turn that off. Okay. I do not like them thick, but he does. So he'll be happy with these. He's making bacon. He's going to make eggs. It's going to be good sitting out here. It's gotten so foggy, though. The fog really rolled in. And you can't see anything anymore. Where's my spoon? Um, back here in the pot. Watch and see if you see him wake them. <gasps> oh, did you hear the horn? It's a ship in the Cape Fear. It's pretty cool. We've been hearing it. So we've got our eggs, grits, and bacon. Not a bad. 
breakfast fixed on a 16 foot boat. Bless our Lord this food to our use and us to thy service and make us ever mindful of the needs of others. In Jesus' name, amen. Breakfast is over. It was really good. Everything's better when you eat it outside, or at least I think so. Um, Kevin's got all the mess cleaned up and still so foggy. We were hoping that it would burn off. I don't know. It looks like it's getting brighter. Anyway, we did it. And I'll do it again. <laughs> Maybe on a better night. Kevin just got out of the boat to pull the anchor up. So he got out from under the net. And the bugs are out there tearing him up. And there's not one single bug in here. I mean, I'm telling you. This is perfect. He did a good job. Oh no. He just dropped his anchor rope in the water. Put that on there. Do what? I wouldn't put that on there. Because you're grouchy. I don't know if you, oh yeah, you can see them. See all these bugs? We just picked these up while we were riding. That's how bad they are. So now we're back out where there's a breeze, probably getting laughed at by every boat that goes by, but whatever. And now Kevin's gonna knock those bugs off and we're gonna get the screen up.